Well, hello everyone. We are about 60 kilometers east of Phoenix, and we are in Tonto National Forest. Again, just some just really, really cool scenery out here with all the Seguro cacti, and we're reading up on them, how long it takes them to grow their first arm, and they're not considered an adult, I guess. Uh, Karen was looking until they're 120 or so years old. Just the more rock formations, and then we got all the cacti throughout here, all the big Seguro cacti, and then another mountain range there. Another cool rock formation straight ahead. So we are headed to, uh, I might have to put it on the screen, an indigenous artifact or cultural center, I believe it is. Probably still about 20 kilometers from here. And then on the way back, we're doing some more sightseeing of just pretty amazing things to look at. It's a good little rest day for the legs today after Camelback Mountain and we played pickleball yesterday and we played pickleball this morning. We're doing the touristy things. Those things are, whew. those are just, yeah. So that rock formation way out there, I'll, pro, I'll try to zoom in after, in post, I guess. That's 4,500 feet tall. So that's, that's got to be at least in feet. I'm going to guess at least 1500 feet Babe. higher than the area around yeah it's, it's superstition mountains are like surrounding it That's oh what okay back there so the mountains back there margo found out that it's called the superstition mountains and i'd like to know what that rock formation is what there's got to be a name to that one too right so we're looking at some geology, <laughs> geology of the area here. And about 18.6 million years ago, we had a cataclysmic pyroclastic eruption, just basically like a volcanic eruption, hundreds of times bigger than Mount St. Helens and it blew everything up in the air and everything settled and just formed all of these different ranges. I found out what this, the furry cactus, and I remember seeing some type of survivor show. Might have been uh, Survivor Man with Les Stroud, but it's called the Choya cactus or teddy bear cactus. And it will actually wrap your, wrap itself around something that gets touched to go towards it almost. Because Karen accidentally touched one with her side of her shoe. And it, and it's, yeah. Oh yeah, look at that. That piece right there. My shoe. <laughs> yeah. I haven't been able to video as we go through this. It's just one 15 kilometer an hour turn after another. But just all the rock formation with the lichen on it. Again, just a, just amazing scenery. Yeah, I'm gonna get off the road. I'm not gonna get hit. Get off the road. Here's so we can have some perspective. See the people there. How 
how expansive that is. Tortilla Flat, that's the name of the place we're going. <laughs> This is where one goes in Arizona when you tell bad dad jokes. Dave, you are sentenced to life. <laughs> All the spring runoff and if you watch the video a little bit longer, you'll see a lake that we, Canyon Lake, I believe it's called, just up the road in the middle of what appears to be the death. And this is the little one-room schoolhouse from almost 90 years ago. Superstition Mountains, and all the artifacts, tributes to all the indigenous people that inhabited the area, and still do, of course. Yeah. This is part of Canyon Lake. the lake I was mentioning, Canyon Lake. So to finish up our day trip today, this is superstition, superstitious, superstition, one of those two mountain behind us here.